Born Helen Williams from Riverton, New Jersey, at an early age, she showed a great obsession for fashion and even began sewing her garments at seven. At 17, personalities such as Lena Horne and Sammy Davis Jr. began to notice her work and urged her to pursue fashion and modeling. Williams worked exclusively with Ebony and Jet magazines. She found successful modeling for famous designers Christian Dior and Jean Dessès. What inspired you? I really don't know. It's I see other people doing it, and I said, maybe I can do it too. And then all of a sudden I saw people going into different places and I thought, I'll try it. And all of a sudden I just found somebody from the studio and they liked what I wanted to do and, and that's where I started. How was your experience in that regard as far as modeling in magazines? I didn't really think about it. You know? I am who I am, and I don't go in and try to be Miss, Miss Cute so-so. But you are cute. I did not say I was. <laughs> if you want to call me that, fine. How is Paris? Oh, it's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, it's, it's, people are very, very nice there, first of all. And it was like an exciting, it was really exciting for, for me to be there at that time. And the people were very nice to me. And they have some nice people there. Polite. Two white journalists, Dorothy Kiljallen and Earl Wilson, wrote about her cause ultimately bringing attention to the exclusion of black models within the modeling and fashion industry. Suddenly, doors began to open, and Williams started getting to work. She was booked for various jobs for brands such as Budweiser, Loom Togs, Sears, and Modest, which crossed over for the first time into the mainstream press in periodicals such as the New York Times, Life, and Red Book. By 1961, her hourly rate had shot up to $100 an hour. I'm just the same as you are, only I got dark cover. And I keep on going and talking, and they don't bother me. And I have no attitude or anything. Another way, especially in, when I went to Paris, I was came in a little America. Everybody says, oh man, what a beautiful woman that is. And I'm thinking, uh, just like every other woman in the place. And I enjoyed myself because people just didn't pick at you and they, oh, who is she? It was, what a wonderful person she is. Because I don't act stupid or anything, I was just this plain me. You know, because it's, 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 what's the sense to go someplace and try to be a, a big shot? I was just me. And I'm still me. And if you don't like me, walk out the door. If I was wanting to be a model, okay. can you give me tips, five tips? You just walk in there and be polite to people, first of all. And you meet people, you talk to people. And that's all I did. I was me. I don't go in trying to be, I'm Miss. <laughs> I'm just Helen Williams. And I like you or I don't like you. But usually I like everybody. Because I try to be nice to people, which I hope they're nice to me. I don't go in acting I'm, I'm Miss So-and-so. Uh-uh, that's not me. I'm a type of person, I think. I believe that I am. I like to talk to people. And I don't act 
give my a attitude. Because that's not gonna help me. So I try to be very friendly and very nice to people. That's how I just got through the whole studios and meeting people. And I don't like to be thinking I'm better than anybody else. I am me. And if you lock me, there's a door. And that's me. <laughs> <Love it. laughs>